Hello everyone and welcome to Game Zombies. My name is Jags and today, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, we are back for Hand of Fate. Now let us see how you fare against the Queen. Part 36... Uh, part is this? Part 10? Is this not part 10, but boss 10? Yes, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 9, dead, dead, this one. Okay, last time. We got the, this, this bad boy. So we got better starting gear, deadly combatant. Blessing blows at the start of adventure, you will be blessed. Skeletons will now reanimate. Ratman warriors will perform leap attacks, and skeletons have their health increased, which is fair enough. They kind of, they kind of sucked. Whoops. So today we are going head to head with Queen of Scales. Queen of Scales, curse luck. The difficulty, the difficulty of picking a successful chance card of a successful chance card is increased. Great. Too bad fortune for lost in the swamp. The great dragon queens of the lizard people are the fiercest warlords and generals. Uh, sounds crappy. Yes, we will go default. Default. No, we got. Do we have everything that chills? No, we don't. Why don't we? Seems a bit silly. Do I have anything that chills? Hmm. Oh, plenty of rings in there, but I'm not sure why they haven't put the chilling frost fang on as a default. But I said I would go default, so I shall stick to default. Plenty of new ones in here though, so that's alright. Whole bunch being missed out again as well, but doesn't matter, doesn't matter. We'll continue. Let's just let's continue on with the fight. Start game. You will find very little success in the Queen's domain. Even fate itself turns against you. Oosh. Minus 50 cent food, was it? Or plus? I missed that. I missed that. I'm not sure if it's plus or minus. Doesn't matter. Boss number nine. Here we go. Ah, boss number ten. Here we go. Come on. Shuffle it in, sucker. These steps you take, none have Ooh. taken before. Oh, what a card to start with. Built? Does it mean Do you understand the elegance on the of the systems attacks? I have forged? Double damage, sir. That is the best possible start. And I am blessed Useful. with... Undead that physically strike the player may re receive damage themselves. Mm -hmm. And up we go. Oh! Hello! I haven't come across this little goblin for a while. I don't think. You've probably been this before, so I shall just skip this one. We have got this guy many a times. Um, so, Goblin Guy. There's his name. What should we give him? Let's give him bread from our plate. Before slapping the table with his head. Aha! I know what you need. Magic is believing in yourself. If you can do that, you can make anything happen. The dealer draws you four gold gain cards. Seven gold. I'm sure you are grateful for that. Oh, that's a nice one. 25 G's. Oh, yeah. One more. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Rich. Let's call this a win. And then he disappears. All right. Let's do our dice roll. So we'll go uh, odds. We'll go up. Evens. We will go to the left. Odds. That's number three. We're going up. The Maiden! Oh, these are all old school ones. There you go. I'm... I'm Methuth. Blah, 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 blah. <laughs> We've done this one heaps. I'm just give this one to uh, The Maiden! What do we want? Do we want gold? We don't need health or long life. Supplies? I reckon we go straight for another blessing here. By whatever strength my people yet hold. May you be protected on your journey. Ah, oh, she's nice. Treasured picker. I made that a little too powerful. I will have to rebalance that next time. Ah, you say that about almost everything. When the player chooses from multiple equipment or gain cards, the choices available are increased by one. All right. Yes, thank you for the magic. All right, let's do it again. So, odds up, uh, evens right. Uh, that's nothing. 
Eleven. We're going up again. Lost in the swamp and stranger in the shadows. Nah, I don't care about those ones. Oh, I don't know actually. Lost in the swamp's a new one, so hopefully we'll come across that in another one. To continue forwards, you must descend down a ladder and into the unknown. You've discovered the exit area. Climb down the ladder. Whoa. What? Why is... Why is... What? Why is that showing itself? I have sat where you sit now. The game, though, the game is very different. I doubt even I would have reached this point. Look <laughs> at my antlers. Look at my antlers. Oh my god. What? Okay. So it must be something to do with this ring. Merchant's ring. Hang on. Hang on. Go back. This will be... All shops are revealed. Ah, here we go. There we go. That's why. Shield, pretty standard. Started with a hat. Got a couple of blessings. Medium armor. And... Just got a regular axe there. Oh, that's cool. Ah, right. Three decisions this time. Alright, so we'll go... So, left is... What? One to six? Yeah, one to six. Uh, 6 to 12 and well no sorry 7 to what 12 and 13 to 18 something like that 15 we're going down looks like we're going to the shop ah oh, crap lost without a clue this is a chance to learn how valuable your equipment can be in oh. the right circumstances uh oh that doesn't sound good <laughs> You become lost in a swamp. In all directions you see nothing but murky water, twisted trees and mist. The smell is appalling. You hear muffled movement and you can just make out a humanoid figure in the mist beckoning to you. Approach the figure. You splash through the murky water towards the shape. As you draw near you realise that it's just a tree. <laughs> a torn old banner is stuck to one of the branches, waving in the cold wind. The dank, misty forest then shudders, surrounds you in an eerie in uh, the d oh god I can't even talk about a rough night last night. <clears throat> the dank, misty forest that surrounds you is eerily quiet as you struggle through the forted waters. Attempt to find a way out of the swamp. Ah oh, crap. Alright. Oh, I see it. Oh, oh a choice. no. Oh, no. Select your that desire. one? Yeah! Fluke. You find your way out of the swamp after only a day of wandering. Ugh. Wait. Oh, don't trigger when I go back. The shady grow. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. We've done the shot one heaps. Greetings, traveler. I have much to offer you. Wonder how much it's going to cost to remove that curse. Can you even remove that curse? Skip. So you can, 300. Wow, we need 300 gold to remove it? Yeesh. Have any good ones to buy? Anything that'll help me? Nah. Alright, all right, well let's just, ah oh, crap. Let's just save it for now. You never know, we might, um, we might get 300 gold. If I get 300 gold to remove it, I'd be pretty happy. Alright, All right, so we'll go odds, odds, right, evens, left. Uh, seven. Going right. The Apprentice. Uh, young wizard practicing his magic in the forest. No, no, but imprint. Ah, here we go. Um, five food or 15 gold? Just give him the gold, who cares? You hand over the gold and the wizard prepares himself for casting. The young wizard waves his thumb, saying, Don't worry, I'm almost always successful in transporting myself to other places. Luggage is a little trickier. So arriving at your destination, you may continue on your journey. Oh, shop right there. Look at that, right there. What brings you to play the game? Ha, <laughs> I know you will not tell me. He asks me this like every episode. Rest. You Every episode. Uh, odds up, evens, we'll go cross. Number one, we're going up. Odds are just my thing. Oh, I found the way out. Look at that. 
These all look depressing. We are skipping. Yes! The next step of your journey takes you from a cave out to the forest, uh, feet of an imposing forest. You've discovered the exit of this area. Yeesh. Fuck on our next leg. Oh, I got an achievement, everyone. It's called Adventurer. Fuck. Adventurer Achievement. I don't even know what it's for, but we shall continue. There's a shop. Two shops. Did you expect me to tell your fortune? A fortune teller is at their most base and despicable when blah, they begin blah, to blah. believe their own lies. Are you done? Of course. I am different. My powers are genuine. <sighs> okay. Are we done this time? Okay, marketplace. <clears throat> a challenge for you, and a token if you succeed. Ooh, I love my, I love me tokens. You arrive and the okay, we're on the market day. The market vendors are buying food today you may offer some food but the amount of gold you receive for it is not guaranteed sell half your food you place half of your food in a sack bought by one of the vendors and stand back to await the end of the day's trading a man approaches you with a chest containing the gold paid for your food Oh. That one. Yeah! You open the chest to discover some gold. Fifteen. Nice. Fifteen! Again. Nice. And the token is now mine. Yeah. Done. Look at that. Okay. I'm actually going to have to spend money on food now. But that's okay. Because there's a shop right here. And we've got 120 gold. Who cares about removing the curse? Um... Let's just get it done. I think I've traveled through this map quite quick so far, to be honest. Uh, we'll see what items he's got, actually, first. Um, every third encounter does not consume food. Nice. Uh, nearby enemies are immediately slowed with chilling effects as your armor take hold. Ooh, how much is that? 45. Ooh. We're, we're fighting lizard people, so I'm kind of... I'm tempted to get that. Yeah, let's buy this. Let's buy it. Because, uh, I mean. <laughs> I clicked buy the wrong buy. Uh, let's buy that. You think that will help you? Yeah, I uh, do actually. Um, sell items. We'll sell this one. It's only worth four, but still. It might get us some more food. Uh, everything else we're wearing. Uh, 10 food for 30. Oh, yeah, nice. Let's get another one just in case. There you go. About half and half. Half food, half gold. So that's pretty good. And let us continue on to the next card. Oh, oh no. Helpful priest, not holy priest. <coughs> you meet a wandering priest who greets you in a friendly manner. For the first, for the small share of your provisions, I will bless you in the name of the old gods. Give the priest half my food. I surely will. Uh, this one? Oh, what? He... He bloody cursed me. Ah, that is oh. one of my favourites. Ah, oh, I messed it up bad. Bloody priest. I tell ya. God damn it. I can't believe I failed that one. This is hard with the cards moving a bit quicker. I keep losing track. Uh, up. Is odds and down is even. Uh, wait, pff, down is evens? Oh my god, I told you it's hard today. <laughs> uh, up is even, down is odds. There you go. How about that? Uh, what number is that? Oh, 13. Right, we're going down. Sorry, we went underneath my monitor. Ooh, maze of traps. Alright, let's do it. You found a goblin treasure cave. Will you enter? Yes! Yes! Let's do it! Maze of traps! Gonna survive the maze of traps! Hopefully with a lot of health! Hopefully! <laughs> Look at my antlers! <laughs> yeah. Alright! Let's do this! Oh, oh no! 
This looks this looks intense as hell. Oh, oh I forgot the controls! <laughs> it's been a while since I played it. Oh, missed it. Ah, oh, damn it, I ran a bit too far there. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Go, go. Whew, that wasn't too bad in the end. I did make a couple of very, very simple mistakes. <laughs> that was terrible. Three game cards. Draw three, select one to keep. I draw four, because I got a bonus. <laughs> Um, when this Every ring is sold, man trade wealth for health. all the player's gold is lost, but the player receives one max health for every five. Huh? No, I go away. That's, that sounds shit. What's this one again? Once per combat, press two to activate an aura that makes every successful. Oh, okay, no, no, no. no. Ah, do I buy the weapon or the gloves? What's the weapon? Every an ancient artifact, huh. honored in song and story. Oh. Come on with this trait, crackle with the thunder of the gods, even mages tremble at the sight, fearing a power beyond their key. Press 1. See, I don't know if I should get that, or these, because these gloves are awesome. Look at the workmanship on these gloves. These gloves Truly are wicked. the work of a master craftsman. Uh, there's not a lot of gloves in this, compared to weapons, so I'm thinking I may actually take these gloves. But if the boss is near, I'm probably better off with the weapon. Mmm, gloves. We'll go gloves. We'll risk it. Oh, wait, wait, never mind. We might get a weapon. Ah, oh, here we go. <laughs> What's this? Ah, a wondrous artifact. Good luck with it. What? 50% chance to grant, to grant one free artifact use per combat. Huh. I don't have any artifacts yet, so. Rat cleaver. 30 damage. And it does a stun. Or. 32 damage. Fire was never meant to be so controlled and so channeled. Mm, let's go rat cleaver. It does more dam- no it doesn't. It does less damage. It does 30. What am I saying? This does 32. Yeah. Yeah. That one. Are you sure that's the right approach? Oh man. Oh, what's this one? Nah. Uh, alright. Cool. And we'll take this guy. Oh, this is ice. No, we need this for the lizard people. During combat, press 2 to create a blast of freezing ice. Centered up. Yeah, 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 we need that one. Oh, nice, that was cool. After opening the chest, the traps lay dormant and you make your way back to safety. Oh, that was cool. Oh, yeah, look at that. Um, so I got that. We got this. And we got a weapon from that round. Wow, nice. That's really nice. Alright, might be a boss, so let's just do this, just to get a bit more health up. Oh no, it's the exit. Devil's Carnival. Hmm. No, it's the exit. We did it! Another round! Down Man, we're flying through more, these levels. Seeking the heart of it all. You have discovered the exit to this area. Take the stairs. 